So it's my second pair of Mecca Riellos today, and I'll do separate videos for each of them because I think that there's a lot more to talk about, especially with these. Um, the first pair is a pair of uh, summer unlined split toes, which are uh, great. I'm actually wearing them now and they feel good. But this, this is my, split toes is my first love. This is my second in the shoe world. And that is an Adelaide, but look how beautiful this is. Baby calf, kudu. The kudu is just such a wonderful texture coming from him. Macariello does just wonderful, wonderful work. Look at that last. Look at that contrast. And look at this color. I mean, this color is color is everything I and mean, how do you how do you compete with this color that color is and the word classic does not do this justice all right we're just going to look at that that way i'm going to put this that way now as you look at this color i want you to think what is something that is a similar color that can even compare to that. And I only have one thing, and it really matches the light of it, and that's that. That's also a Macariello. It's not as dark. You know, he did this himself. This isn't for Yoso. <laughs> Look at those heels. That is so cool. Look at that sole. I mean, come on, look at that. I'm so glad that he got that instruction. This is, I am, I am pumped, is what I am. I am so excited about that. And you know, I have, um, these have that, uh, those nails. These, these soles last. They are really, really good. And this is just gorgeous. So I am uh, super excited, pumped even, and uh, super excited to share this with all of you. So let me know what your thoughts are and what you think of this level of detail. Now this is not a hand welted shoe. This is part of his Argentum, ready to wear. So this is a Principus II and uh, is made on his, you know, altered Goodyear welting platform so that he's able to uh, deliver it at a better price point. Just incredible. The kudu is incredible. And having him offer this in a patina service where I could choose these different patinas versus just going with the burgundy one, I'm, I'm speechless. This is so nice. And again, with that sole, just makes it so unique. It's um, it's got to be one of the most attractive shoes in my arsenal, and I'm 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 speechless. So, anyway, uh, let me know what you think. Thanks.